An alleged incident of animal cruelty in Gardner late last week led to the arrest of a 63-year-old woman and the seizure of five dogs. Authorities called the home where the animals lived, one that was heaped in garbage and fecal matter, appalling. Jill Hamilton now faces one misdemeanor count of animal cruelty per dog. The animals are now being cared for at the Ulster County SPCA. They're of a healthy weight. Uh, we're not alleging that she failed to feed them, uh, but the environment they were living in leads to other underlying conditions. Yeah, they're o overall just, just filthy, dirty, matted, caked in uh, you know, fecal material and, and garbage. The whole thing has reignited discussion in Ulster County about regulating breeders. Last year, a law was proposed by Ulster County Executive Michael Hine that would subject dealers to licensing and inspections. But the resolution was blocked by a handful of legislators and never made it to the floor for a vote. There was uh, quite a bit of pushback last time. I think that there was some misinformation that was brought forward and some confusion. And um, I, I hope to uh, do a better job of, of stifling the misinformation uh, in the coming weeks as we, as we discuss this. Nevertheless, officials at the SPCA believe the resolution needs to be brought up again, especially in light of the case in Gardner on Friday. If the law had been in place a decade ago, she might have received the help she needed back then, and it may have never reached this point. Uh, I mean, that has to be considered rather than it being looked at as some sort of, um, the word that was used repeatedly to me uh, last summer was uh, some sort of stormtrooper operation. Not the case. Uh, at least. That is not how we would seek to uh, to carry out the inspections. Now Hamilton, who authorities say is a registered AKC breeder of Shetland Sheepdogs, is due to appear in Gardner Town Court to be arraigned on Wednesday. In Kingston, Paula Mitchell, HVNN.com.